Hello? Can you hear me? Yes. Okay, great. Okay, so um, you ju it's just you and me now. Mm -hmm. um, let's just, uh, just three minutes. If um, and no one else joins, then we'll start the class, okay? Okay, thank you, ma'am. All right. Hello? Mm -hmm. Hello? Okay, so we have um, one more person now. Okay. So let's start. So we're going to be doing a two-step equation. The first class, which was last week, we did uh, we did one-step equation. All right. So two-step equations. Uh, we're going to be doing several examples. Okay, mm -hmm. for today's class, and uh, we did one-step equation in the other class, which I've uploaded on the on the on a, on my YouTube channel. That's DTWGED prep. Okay, that's the YouTube channel. Let me write it here DTWGED prep. Okay, so you can check that out if you didn't uh, follow the first class. Okay, so this what is the, the first one? T? Did Comic the for what uh, website? On YouTube. Mm -hmm. On YouTube, which one? Yeah, on YouTube, just search. D T W G E D prep. Oh, okay. I got it. Thanks. Okay. All right. Or oh, if if you're on the WhatsApp group, or are you on the WhatsApp group? I tried to join last time. I think I'm not. Okay. Or oh, on the Facebook uh, Facebook group, you should see you should see you should see a link to this. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right. So um uh, so two step equations. So let's say we have this for an example. We are told to solve this. Uh, 5y plus 3 bracket y plus 2. Close the bracket equal to 54. Can you do this? Can anyone do this? Me, I cannot, I think. Okay, you cannot. So let's do it together. Okay. okay. So now we have this, we have to first of all open up these brackets, all right? So yep. we have 5y plus, so we have 5y plus, in opening this bracket, that's the distributive uh, property, okay? So we say 3 times y, which is what? 3y, and 3 times this 2 here, it will be what? A plus, you know, this is 3 multiplying mm -hmm. a plus 3 multiplying a plus 2. So we have a plus what? 6 equal to 54. All right. So we are going to collect like terms. All right. So you keep um, the numbers with the variables. That's the numbers with the letters will be on your left hand side. Why just only numbers will be on the right hand side. So we are going to take this plus 6 to this side. So we have here 5y plus 3y equal to 54. Taking plus 6 to the other side will be a negative what? 6. Okay? So from mm -hmm. here, 5y plus 3y will give us what? 8y equal to 54 minus 6. What will this give us? 54 minus 6. Let's calculate it together. I think it should give 48. Okay, so we have 48. So from here, what do you do? To get your y, we have to divide both sides by 8. So we divide here by 8 divide by 8. So this 8 will cancel out here. So we have left y is equal to 48 divided by 8. How many times would it go? It will go 6 times. So our answer here for y is equal to 6. Are you following? Yes, but I have a question. Why the 54 minus 6? Yes, 54 minus oh. 6 is 48. No, I mean uh, the 5y plus 3y plus 6, but why is you, you guys know why it is minus 6? Okay, yes, in maths, um, mm -hmm. you know, we have to separate. Were you in the first class or have you watched the first class video? No, I didn't. Okay. If I watch the first class video, I will get it. It's on, it's, it's, it's on the DTWGED prep, yeah. okay? <laughs> So, uh, but nevertheless, let me, because I have to digress now a bit. 
But uh, when you have this, okay, in equations, mm -hmm. that's why it's called two-step equation. You have to arrange, all right? The mm -hmm. numbers with the variables, the letters, have to be on your left-hand side, while just numbers alone has to go to your right-hand side. So when you have a positive, when this positive is crossing over to, to, to this side, the sign would change to a negative. Oh, okay. Okay? So that's why this positive came here to become a negative one, six. Okay, are I'm you- I'm sorry, this okay. class will be in YouTube too? Come again? This class will be in YouTube too? Yes, I would, uh, I would um, try to upload it, okay? Okay. So you could rewatch it. Yes. Okay. And uh, I need to watch the first video then. Yes, yes, you do. You do. You do need to. And uh, if 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 you know you have uh, problems like uh, in maths, maybe some foundational problems that you need clarification on, I do one-on-one -on -one tutorials. So you can also contact me. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. So to just help you clarify your foundation, to help you move further on your own. All right. So we have this. So six is equal to this. So let me do one more. All right. We're going to do it together. Then um, I'll give you one more to try. Is that okay? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. So let's say we have five y is equal to 2y plus 22 plus y. Okay. Are, we, are, we, are you with me? Yes. Yes. All right. So here, what do we have? We have 5y equal to 2y plus 22 plus y. So now we have to take, as I said earlier on here, all the numbers with variables or variables alone, we have to do what? Oh. We have to take them to this side. Okay? Yes. Are you following me? Yes. Yes. Okay. So we have here 5y, taking this, this is a positive 2y. Okay? Taking this positive 2y to this side, it becomes a negative or 2y. Now we have a, another positive y alone here. Taking this positive to the other side, it becomes a negative or y equal to what we have left here is a positive or 22 which you can leave this way okay mm -hmm. so from here what do we have 5y minus 2y is a 3y okay and 3y minus y what would this give us it will give us 2y so this is equal to 22 equal to what 22 from here to get our y, our y we divide both sides by 2 so divide here by two, this will cancel out. We're left with y. And um, what is the uh, division of two, uh, 22 divided by two will give us what? 11. So our answer here is 11. Are you with me? Yes. yes. Okay, I, I hope you, you're with a pen and paper taking notes. Yeah, I have. Okay, now can you try this please? I'm gonna give you something harder to try. <clears throat> Can you try this now? I'll give you just a few minutes. Okay? Mm -hmm. Okay. How are we doing? Has anyone gotten an answer? Not yet. Hello? Hello? Anyone with an answer yet? Not yet. I'm not yet. Okay, okay. 152? No? No. It's you say your answer is? I can do it. Like, so much. No. This, this is okay. This is another one. This is the other one that she just put. You're not doing it. This thing in here. 36. It's a um, 38. And then, yeah. 
I got 22. I don't know. <laughs> you got 22? Yeah. Okay. B is equal to 22. Okay. Yeah, Which that's it. You got? Debbie. Okay, let's do this. Let's do this together now. Okay, so we have 38 equal to 5 bracket uh, minus 3 plus 3b plus 1. Okay, so we have to, let's open up this bracket. Okay, so we have here 38 is equal to uh, 5 times 2b will give us what? 10b. Oh, that's why. This is b when I put it. And 5, are you following me? Yes. And five times minus three will give you a minus what? Fifteen. Fifteen. Yeah. Okay. Then we have a plus three b plus one. So here now we have to I'm take. Sorry. We have to take. Can we get the fifty? Can I go on? Yes. Yes. We have to take now all the variables to this side and bring the numbers to this side. Okay. So yes. let's take uh, this positive b to this side will give us what a negative 10b. This positive 3b will give us taking it to this side, we are going to have a negative 3b equal to what do we have left here. We it have a negative 15 plus one. Then don't forget this 38 here. We take this 38 to this other side, it's a positive 38. It will be a negative what 38. All right. Now we have to add this up. Okay. And uh, I don't know if you if you've seen the video on um, understanding plus and minus rules. Minus minus plus, right? Yeah, it's on the YouTube channel. You can also watch that. Okay. So yep. for for this, a minus 10 minus three oh, no. would give you what a minus 13 b. Okay, oh, nice. equal to, here we have a minus 15 plus 1 will give us a minus 14, and a minus 14 minus 38, let's calculate that. We're going to add this. So we have a 38 plus a 14, so this is a 2, carry 1, 1 plus this is a 4 plus this is a 5, so we have 52. So it's equal to what? A minus 52. So we have a minus 13b here. So to get B, we divide both sides by minus 13. Divide by minus 13. This minus 13 will cancel out this minus 13. The minus here will cancel itself out here. And 13 in 52, how many times will it go? Uh, it's, uh, it will go two, uh, is it two times? No, it will go four times, okay? Okay, 52 divided by 13 is four. Let us confirm that by saying yeah. Yeah. That Okay, you agree, right? If yes. we, uh, okay, okay, it's correct then, because this four times this is fifty-two, so B is equal to what four. So this is the answer. B is equal to four. Did any other person get four? Are you with me? Yes. Yes. Okay. Okay, let's, uh, can you try to do this? Mm -hmm. I think this one, was, was it quite difficult for you? Was it quite difficult? No, we yes. can try again, another one. Okay, try this easy one now. <clears throat> it says 17 minus 4z or z plus 2z is equal to 13. Nine. Have 17 minus 4z plus 2z is equal to 13. Can you try this now? Mm -hmm. Anybody with an answer? You got two. You said z is equal to 2? Mm -hmm. Okay, let's do it together then. So we have 17 minus 4z plus 2z equal to 13. 
So let's take this 17 to the side. So we have left here a minus 4z plus 2z is equal to 13. Taking this plus 17 to this side, we have a negative what 17. So here, a minus 4z uh, plus 2z will give us what a minus 2z equal to a 13 minus 17 will give us what a minus what 4. Oh, I see you got mm -hmm. it then. Okay, right, uh, great, great job. So we have we have to divide both sides by minus two to get our z. So this will cancel out. This negative will cancel out this negative here, and then four divided by two is two. So our z here is two. This is the answer. Great job. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna give you one more again to try. All right. Yep. Um, can I clear the screen? Yep. Okay. Is everyone with me? Are you following? Yes. Okay. You can hear this. <clears throat> so can you try this? 35 is equal to x plus 7 plus 6x. Let's try this. Any answer yet? What is the answer? I got five or five point four or I don't know. Anybody yet? One 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 second. Okay. okay. I got four. You five got? point four. Yeah, I got four. Five point. You got four. Uh huh. Okay. Okay. And you say you got five point four. Okay. Let's let's do it together then. So here we have thirty five equal to okay. x plus seven plus six x. So let's take um, the values of the variables to the other side of the equation and take the numbers to this side. Okay. X. So taking this first of all, taking this x to this side, we have a negative x. Taking this positive 6x to this side, it will, it's going to become a negative 6x. Then we have equal to, we have a 7 left here. And taking this 35 to this side, we have a negative what, 35. All right. So here we have a negative x mm -hmm. minus 6x. Mm -hmm. It was for a negative 7x. Equal to, yeah. We have a 7 minus uh, 35. We're going to have a negative what? Um, that's going to give us what? A negative 28. All right. So here we divide both sides by a negative 7. Divide by a negative 7. Okay. I see you got it. Okay. So this minus 7 will cancel out this minus 7. And this minus will cancel out this. And 7 would, uh, 28 divided by 7 will give us what? A4. Okay. So great job, great job. You got this, okay? It's a four. The answer is a four. Okay, where, where did you make this mistake? You got 5.4. Have you seen your mistake? Hello? Yeah, I, my, I minus the six, yep. I did all minus like six plus, no, six X minus one X, it's five X, right? Oh, okay. That's what you did. Oh, oh, okay. Okay. I, I, I've, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, try to watch that video on understanding the plus and minus sign rules. It will help you out. Okay. Very well. Okay. When solving mm -hmm. equations. Okay. All right. So, mm -hmm. um, um, do this one, um, this, uh, final one Then I'll give you, I'll give you some, um, just an assignment. Okay. Is that okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, try this. You have 5p minus 2 is equal to 6p minus 9. Try this quickly. 5p minus 2 equals 6p minus 9. Anyone with an answer? Not yet. <laughs> okay, we have to be fast because... Uh, this on I'm on the Zoom basic plan, which is just uh, 40 minutes free. 
Oh, great. Seven. Okay, you got P is equal to seven, right? Mm -hmm. I got something. Okay, oh, great. Okay, let's do it together seven. then. Yes. Okay, let's do it together then. So here we have 5P minus 2 equal to 6P minus 9. Mm. So let us collect like terms, okay? So we're mm. taking this 6P mm. to this side, and we'll take this negative 2 to this side. So we have 5P, taking this positive 6P to this side becomes what a negative 6P is equal to, we have a negative 9 here, then taking this uh, negative 2 to this side, it becomes what a positive what? So here, what do we have? A 5p minus uh, 6p, what would this give us? This will give us a minus p, okay? Equal mm -hmm. to a minus 9 plus 2, give us what? A negative what? 7. So from seven. here, when you have a negative on the both sides, it would what? Cancel out, okay? So we have p is equal to 7. Great job, great job, okay? So I'm, I'm glad you guys, you, you, you all are getting it right now. It's good? Are you? Yes. Yes. Okay. And I hope, I hope you've, taken, uh, you've taken something from this class. Yes, I did. Thank you. Okay. So uh, I want you to try this. Um, let me give you a tough one so we do together. Let me see if you can get it, then we'll do it together. Okay? So if you have a five brackets a 2x minus 10 okay or wait let me let not this let me give you something a bit longer so you have a 10 minus 3b plus 3 is equal to minus one plus brackets b plus two okay this is a bit tricky but I, i'm sure you can get it just um know how to play around with your sign okay try this now i'm sorry that's a 10 plus two this one you say it's this oh no the the last thing the last part that's a 10. no this is plus plus bracket open it's a bracket uh -huh. and what is the, the what is the, the things on the middle on the middle it's this b? is b b okay. letter b plus two okay thank you because uh, i put 10. okay B plus two. My answer is uh, five. I got five too. Okay, two. great. Let's do it together then. So we have 10 minus 3B plus 3 equal to minus 1 plus this. Okay, so here, let me start here. So we have to arrange, okay? So we have here, uh, first of all, let's just open up this bracket here. So in open up this bracket, we have a minus one. This is just a positive multiplying everything here. So we have a uh, positive B plus a two, okay? So which this is 10 minus three B plus three. So let us arrange now. So we have minus three B here, bring this plus B to this side, it becomes a minus B equal to we're left here with minus one plus two taking this 10 to this side we have a negative 10 and taking this three to this side we have a negative three here we have a negative three b my uh, neg uh, minus uh, b we have a negative four b equal to a negative one plus two will give us a positive one and a positive one minus 10 will give us a negative nine and a negative nine minus three, what would that give us? That would give us a negative what, 12, okay? So here we have, we have to divide both sides by a negative four to get B. So we have divide by negative four, divide by a negative four. So this cancels out, we have B is equal to, this cancels out, and 
uh, 12 divided by 4 is a 3. Okay, this is the answer. No. Okay, where was your error? Let me know. Let me know your error. Okay. Have, you, have you seen uh, your, 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 uh, the error you made? Mm -hmm. Where? Which part of the equation? Mm, I think on the big point that because uh, I didn't I didn't cut the four. Okay, you didn't put the four here. Um, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. I didn't cross the four. I just divided by it. Why do I? I don't know. Okay, okay, okay. O okay, all you need is more practice. Okay. Mm -hmm. So all you need is more practice. You can see you really need to know how to collect like terms, how to play around with your signs, which is very critical. Critical. OK? okay. So just uh, we're going to um, end the class today. And uh, you can do this as a take home assignment. And um, let me know the answer on the group, on the Facebook group, uh, I mean, on the WhatsApp group. So do this. This is S or is it a five? I'm sorry. Okay, this is S. Yeah, that one. This is S. Okay. Oh, S. 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 Plus yeah. six two. Okay. And you can try this also. Five N. And that is the what is the last one? Five S or five? No, this is S. S. Okay. S minus two. two. Minus two is minus two. Okay, so you try these two assignments and uh, let me know the answer on the WhatsApp group. Okay. Is yes. that okay? Yep. Yes. And if you need um, further tutoring, personal one on one, you can also contact me. On the group too okay all right okay thank you thank so much you. for joining today's class thank you i appreciate mm -hmm. okay see you thank next you. week have okay. a great day yep, bye. okay thank you yeah bye